In zombies, death is everywhere. Most players try to avoid it, but others can't get out of its way. Every game we fight a new war against zombies, creatures, falls, lava, and electricity. There's a lot of ways to get downed. The rounds that we achieve are a miracle. As every game we play, we face a thousand zombie deaths. Even a trampoline at the trampoline room is a quick way to get back to the roof. These players are making the trip to get fresh trampolines, but falling too closely is not always the best thing to do. The first player to take the jump lands on the trampoline and is flung back. The other player jumps before they realize what's going on. This results in a mid-air collision, sending both players on a one-way trip to the street below. Teamwork is normally a good thing, but these players had a fling with destiny. When a player spends the points to open an area, they expect to be able to run in it. But what happens when this player leaves their area to go revive a teammate? They come back to see that their yard has been invaded by another player, and that player refused to leave. He gives them one last chance to leave. It's obvious the other player's plan on staying. He lets him know he's going to take him down. He gathers up some zombies and heads back to the yard. When he enters the backyard, he gives the player a bump, causing him to redirect his route. As the player tries to navigate the zombies, he gives him another bump, pushing him against the stairs. Unable to escape, he goes down. The quickest way to turn an ally into an enemy is to invade their space. He tried to be sly, but it caused him to die. And now, he's grounded. The bus is a popular mode of transportation and transit. This player decided it would be a good idea to ride on top of the bus, and he enjoyed an uneventful trip to the bus station. Little did he know he was about to step into a hot situation, because when riding the bus, sometimes it's a dismount that you have to watch out for. He stepped off the bus and into a pit of lava. He desperately looks for an exit from the lava, but before he can succeed, the bus covers the lava pit, taking away any chance of escape. It doesn't take long for the fire damage to take its toll. He soon goes down. His friend comes to his aid, but is chased away. Eventually, he's revived. The victory is short-lived as he soon goes down again. His friend doesn't give up and continues to revive him, but he continues to go down. Before the bus moves, he ends up getting downed and revived a total of nine times. He finds out the hard way that riding above the bus might be all the rage, but the real hot spot is underneath. The roof is a popular area to hold down, and when working as a team, it can be very effective. These two players were working together to do just that, but when they added grenades to the mix, things took a turn for the worse. It was the player in the back that started throwing grenades to the front. The frontline player decided the grenades weren't going far enough and started picking them up and re-throwing them. One of the grenades was already cooked too long and blew up in his hands. He was in a good place until his grenade blew up in his face in the most dangerous game of hot potato. Being chased by more zombies than you can handle, it's sometimes wise to seek the support of a teammate. They would attempt to hold down this area together. For a while, everything was going great. And then as things started to get hectic, it spun out of control. Zombies were breaking through their gunfire and getting into their area. With limited room to maneuver, any wrong step could be your last step. Feeling the pressure, they ran to escape. In doing so, they barely avoided colliding and causing each other to get trapped. But then their luck ran out. One player bumped into the other player, blocking his exit. When he came over to get some help, he had no idea he'd inadvertently become the decoy. He tried to escape his fate, but instead, 
he ran right into it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel and visit the Center for Zombie Control.